from the way he dealt with cars. Three men got some food, yeah, they learned a lesson hard. Then the shooting started when the first man went drawing. Too slow he was, like his friends. He heard the Red Reaper's call. So if, uh, if you're ever in a town town playing poker with Shifty at the table, cut your losses, don't let him kneel, and leave him while you're still able. Thank y'all very much. Now, I was, uh, I was working on this, uh, this ranch over in Louisiana one time, and I was kind of homesick. And uh, I pulled out my cell phone and punched a few buttons and talked to the people back home, and I got over that homesick feeling. Then I got to thinking, what about the encounter was on the, on the trail many, many years ago? They leave home, might not see home for six months, six years, or ever. I wondered what was going through their mind. And then the wind thought me stirred the cool country out. I think I'm old. Wish I was there. My mom, my pa, all my kin, oh, how I long to see the kid. Well, the, the campfire flickers and lights up the sky and sleep just won't come no matter how hard I try. You see, it's been years since I hit the trail, just riding and rolling, playing raising hell, and all the cow towns I've seen, brothels, bars, though I survived, I got my share of scars from good slingers and a cow who pulled out a knife and a hook to get the frying pan from a best friend's wife. Yeah, she hit me right square in the head, took off a holler and left me for dead. But I'm a tough old cuss, hard to keep. Father time won't give me. Yes, sir, he will. Well, the sun is coming up. It's cracked on. I stir the coals and put some coffee on. Then I pick up my bed and saddle fade. Rolling smoke keeps a glorious day. And then, then I round up that herd because it's time to move on. And for cowpoke like me, the saddle, well, the saddle is home. Now, growing up, my, my grandpa on my dad's side, he was, a, he was a judge. My granddaddy on my mama's side, he was a preacher. So I was raised with the law on one side and grace on the other. That kind of influenced a lot of what I do. And this here is called uh, the Cowboys Last Epistle. The saddle sitting quietly in the corner. It had it hanging by the door. Leather chap draped across the sofa. The jingle of his spur, you'll hear no more. And there's the old Will used Bible. It's been passed down hand to hand. The cat boy got it from his father when he became a man. <coughs> Faithfully, he read it pages from the time he was just a kid. And he took the word to heart. Yeah, the book checked the things he did. Then one day he said, I'm leaving. Sat on the pony and hit the trail and had his mother shed her tears. His father said, Don't worry, Mom. She was well. Well, the kid took the road he wanted, the, the trail that's traveled home, and at times he didn't get lost from riding towards his fight home. And those troubles tried to find him in every corner that he turned. The word was there to remind him that the fire of hell still burned. Yeah, Satan was his opponent in the war of our earthly soul, but with Jesus as his partner, this cowboy proved the word of God. His faith, his faith I'm here to tell you, was a gift that was heaven sent, and at the battle rate around him, he said, Father, I repent. And on my knees I pray my soul you will keep from the many dangers as I drift off to sleep. And Father, won't you bless me till we speak again with love and adoration. 
In Jesus' name, amen. Well, this night of prayer, the cowboy said, it made strong his will to hit his knees down at the cross on top of Calvary's head. And the cowboy hungered daily for the man he received, and his faith grew stronger each day that he believed. Then one day, while he was riding on the trail to another town, he heard the father calling, and from the south, he stepped back. He swapped his lariat upon the pulpit, all so that he could rope. He had packed the pews on Sunday, preaching cowboy that only hope. Well, each Sunday morning at sunrise, the church bell he would ring, the farmers and the cowboys together, they would sing. Then, then he had preached fire and brimstone. Yeah, everybody knows that a preacher, he ain't preaching unless he's stepping on his toes. Now, friend, you're always welcome, even if you're running late, but try to hear quietly as we're passing around the plate. Payment ain't required to get on him and roll together. Pour his soul among us and have a mansion. Let him go. And the preacher that stands before you when he rides a narrow trail. Yeah, he tell a fragment of her and sinners out of hell. But that preacher, he ain't answered to the question of your soul and Jesus just to wait to have your name to heaven grow. Now, partner, I know you're burning hell. Because eternity for you is lost. All your sins have wages, but you can't pay the cost. Now, it don't take no money for you to pay the bill. Just get your knees down at the cross on top of Calvary's head.
the uh, piano man, well, he took a back all throughout this night. We the lively to him. He set the stage for the contest for tonight. The dance, the dance the pair was dancing, it had a step that you could keep. With the law man there to serve the law on the river there to read it. Anger filled the river's eyes. The law man felt his icy grip. Well, his battle had been long and hard. And then let the fingers slip. The moon was high and shining. Bright were the streets of dirt. The fury of the fire was dim. Both the fighters hurt. Then the law man grew right to the breath. His fingers squeezed one final squeeze. The reaper stumbled backwards and the outlaw dropped with just one knee. With one hand in the pistol, the law man in the reaper's sight, the reaper he let out a high, an outlaw laughed in the night. Well, the good Lord had been watching. That fire of hell was growing hot. The reaper he came for a righteous man, but the good Lord worried not. The outlaw life turned dark. He inhaled the reaper's wrath when he pulled the pistol trigger and set up on the perdition's path. The ball was in the quick pot. The reaper packed the powder well, but an angel closed the barrel. Now the outlaw was on the head. As I sit here, sit here and watch this battle, good and evil stirred dust, I pondered as a battle raged between the wicked and the just. Who was this tough old law man? When we went to town. How did he know the evil that beat the good folks down? What stirred deep within the will standing by, toe to toe with the reaper? Who guides this man tonight? His pistol moved like his speed. I've never seen the light before. What sort of power did this man have to stop Satan at the door? Did I pick up that broken bottle? I looked up and I inquired. What burned within his soul? How was he so inspired? And with his hand he brushed a tear from his weary eye. He bowed his head and pointed. The broken finger to the sky. Don't be his last. 